Ooh, 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 look at that now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hello everyone, it's Lisette and welcome back to my channel. This is like the first time I am filming since, oh my goodness, June? Maybe July? June. It has to be June. I'm so excited to be back. I know I have been filming on my phone over the summer and the kind of vlog style so you can check out some of those videos. Um, I don't know maybe there's a playlist maybe there's a card over here I am trying to get back into the swing of things but uh, it's gonna take me a little bit I figured today I've got a couple of things I've been so busy with work and kids going back to school that I received my, my boxy charm my October boxy charm and I is it October or what is this I think it has to be September oh my goodness I think it was the September Boxy Charm, and I haven't opened it yet. Um, and then my friend Marta from uh, Pretty Plus and 360 uh, did her Q&A, and I missed it. What kind of friend am I that I missed the Q&A? That's how busy I've been with life. Um, so I figured maybe I piggyback off of her and try a Q&A um, one of these days. I don't know. You let me know if you want to see it. If you have any questions. You know what to do there's a comment section that is just for you guys okay what am i doing today why do i have you here um i've been seeing all summer the cut crease kind of makeup look um and i'm gonna be honest with you guys it scares me it scares me because one i have i guess a little bit hooded eyelids so i'm not sure if you'll be able to see it i don't know how to do it <laughs> But what better thing to do than to get over my fears? So cut crease it is. Um, my last, the July boxy charm, I received the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Volume Two palette, and that has a lot of like dark, smoky um, colors. Look how beautiful that is. I'm a mermaid person, and this excites me very much so let's see all right it's, it has darks I, I don't know if this is gonna be like um, a charcoal gray or maybe a navy I don't know I can't knock it so we'll, we'll play with that with a little bit I think that'll be nice in the crease so maybe to smoke it up look at me talking like I know how to do things that are on the floor all right I kind of want some color I'm gonna end up most definitely using this one this is my like if i want to go out and have a good time and, and do all these beautiful pops of color <gasps> look at it it's gorgeous i love this i don't care what any other reviews say the tartiste the tardis however you say it pro palette that's my jam but first let me take a sip of coffee mm. Alrighty. So now we kind of have an idea of what we want to do, which is like a smoky, really pretty cut crease thing. Let's prep the skin. I'm going to be trying the new CoverGirl Vitalist Healthy Elixir Foundation. Woo! Um, the color I chose was 742, which was kind of, it was the closest to my Wet n Wild shade. This here, I, I kind of like and you know we shall see how it turns out i don't prime my face in case you don't know um i just don't prime my face why i don't know <laughs> i don't is it something i should do do you think that's like a big no-no um i never really i've never seen the difference when it comes to priming versus not priming um I don't know, why do I put it? I don't know, I hate like having to do this. I kind of am used to the Wet n Wild spatula because you apply it to the face where you want it and then you're done. And I know some of you have been talking about how you're not crazy about how my camera auto focuses all the time while I'm 
doing my makeup and you can't really hear me that well I understand that there's a problem I'm really trying to fix it um, I think you guys would prefer in focus videos to out of focus videos because I do this on my own I don't have uh, I don't have a partner to help me an assistant the kids are in school my husband's at work and I don't you know and to be honest YouTube's a little secret so I think he knows I have it my husband has to know I have a YouTube account and YouTube videos maybe I don't know but it's out there it's on the internet he can find me whatever it's not like I'm doing anything raunchy or bad it's just you know it's my thing and at this moment he I'm I'm sure I may have told him <laughs> maybe not but it's okay he's super supportive in everything that I do and I he is one of the biggest biggest supporters of me and my photography it kind of it was something that I grew up with and then I kind of not that I forgot about it just life happens and you don't really the things that you love and the hobbies that you like to do kind of fall to the wayside and then you know I picked it up again and I actually brought him I was shooting a wedding um, last month and I brought him as my assistant so there's my my husband who is normally a you know sneakers sweats shorts <laughs> tan tank top kind of guy nice and looking so handsome in a suit and tie carrying around my equipment <laughs> while I chase around a bride and a groom on the dance floor now that's love I can tell you that all right, so um, this is my Rimmel Stay Matte powder. Um, I'm gonna be using. <laughs> I'm so sad. Okay, so this is my butter bronzer. Literally, while I was setting up the camera, <sighs> it fell. Oh no, it's falling now. <sighs> Just a moment of silence for my bronzer. I don't know. I'm gonna try and work with it right now. Is this like a DIY fix it type of thing? Maybe I'll do it for you guys. I'm just really sad. It was so expensive. Granted, I really did use up a lot of it. So I just needed a little longer. I'm going on vacation with my BFF for four days. And then I don't have bronzer. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. I'll take this with me. I'll put it in a Ziploc bag and forget it. I'll be using the little, these little chips the whole vacation. And then I'll get a new one after the vacation. Where are we going? Did you not see my last makeup video? We're going to Universal and Disney. No, we will not be doing Halloween Horror Nights. We discussed this already. We're doing the Food and Wine Festival, and then we're doing the two parks. Two parks in one day, and then um, Disney on another day, and then we're just going, we're just going to be little piggies. We're going to eat, 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 and um, just have a grand old time. All right. Oh, no. You know what I forgot? <laughs> Not that I forgot. Most of these YouTube gurus do their eyes first, then their foundation. Should I have done that? Oh well, it's too late now. Oh, I need like makeup brushes. Or cut crease. And... I don't know. These are alright, so these are the brushes that I have that I guess I'll use. They're clean. Mm. And this brush, this brush is ancient. This is from when I used to sell Avon, and Avon had like a sister company called Mark for the younger, the younger girls and generations. And so, I don't know, maybe I'll use this one. Color palette wise, okay. I've been trying my hardest to get like good at this for you guys. I don't know if it's gonna work, but we're gonna try. All right, so we need the transition color. 
have my fluffy brush and we're gonna go into this one right here it's called conch like a conch towel I've got two mirrors one in my hand and one below me oh this is a little light this is very light it's pretty but I don't know if this is what we needed at the moment because I know like if a, there's a cut crease you're supposed to shape it with your your concealer or something like that I don't know I I didn't pre I didn't prep as much as I would normally prep for something like this um, I don't think I want to do a very dark like a black cut crease I think I'm going to go in with maybe um, this one is called vamp maybe I'll do let's do drama first and then we'll build it up with vamp dramas like a dark wine color all right guys pray with me oh my god am i doing it right okay i'm just trying to make sure that you guys can see my cut crease when my eye is open so and then i gotta drag it out here now, when we have a cut crease, are we supposed to have like eyeliner as well? Because maybe I can connect the cut crease to my eyeliner. I got questions, y'all. Lots and lots of questions. So, how do you guys like my hair? The last time you saw me, I was straightening it. And most of my videos, my hair is straightened. But the summer is long and hot and straight hair doesn't always stay straight. <laughs> so I have embraced my beautiful curls and the frizz that comes with it. Hold on. I don't know about this cut crease, guys. It's okay. We're going to try new things. All right. So I have... Hold on, my right, this one looks better than this one, so let's remedy that. There we go. So my bestie just texted me, hey, have you thought of any hashtags for our trip? I said, no, I'm thinking about them. We're going to be in Disney Universal, so thinking MILFs of Disney two girls one snack because we're doing the food and wine festival you get it i need some for um when we go to universal and harry potter so if you think of any put them in that comment box below all right so hmm, can you see them can you see my cut crease so now that i have that base down i'm gonna go in with vamp on this little little bitty brush and I'm gonna darken it. Oh my god. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's scary. That was really dark. Oh boy. Oh. Mm, you get a little on the inside. Oh boy. And then I can use my concealer, right guys? I can use my concealer to fix any mistakes. But I'm afraid. Okay. Alright, blend it out is good. I need to... Hold that thought, because this uh, is bothering me. Oh, this cleans up nice. Okay. 
I'm not as scared. Hold on, maybe I'll, I'll just put it on this. All right, I'm liking the way this eye is coming out. This eye, woo doggy. Because I see some really awesome cut creases with like um, jewels and gems. And I'm like, ooh, one day, one day I will try it. We're going to put my hair over this one. <laughs> All right, let's do eyeliner and we'll connect it. There's, there's my eyeliner. Let's do this side. This is the Kat Von D um, Tattoo Liner in Trooper. I did find a dupe for it. The NYX Mega Liner. It's a pretty good dupe for it, but this lasts longer than the Mega Liner. But the Mega Liner has a better price point. Now I'm gonna go in with my um, L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise, which is supposedly a dupe for the Better Than Sex Mascara. Don't mind my face. So, I have this on my face. I need a blush. I need a blush. All right, what blush do I have in here? I have my Too Faced Love Flush Blush in Love Hangover. Ooh, whoa. I forgot how pigmented that was. Ooh. Okay. And for lips, I'm going to do a combo of my Buxom uh, Matte Sinful Cinnamon and my NYX Butter Gloss and Tiramisu. This is like my favorite, favorite, favorite color. I love it. Mmm. Oh my goodness, this is everything, oh, yes, 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 I'm supposed to set the face, NYX matte finishing, I can never pronounce this, mm. this is the matte finish spray, finishing spray from NYX, alright, so what I did was, I sprayed my face with my finishing spray and I'm gonna go over my face with my beauty blender. Why, you might ask? Because sometimes the finishing spray might leave splotches, like spray marks on there and we're just gonna finish it out. You know what this eye look reminds me of? Ursula from The Little Mermaid. Mm. Y'all, you didn't tell me I had eyelash stuff on there. It's okay. This eye, remember, we're going to hide it with my hair. Well, this is it. This is my attempt, my version of a cut crease. I hope you like it. Don't forget to leave some comments down below or let me know that you didn't like it. It's okay. It's YouTube. Judge me. Don't judge me. I still love you. Um... Yeah, and that's it. That's today's look. I hope you have a wonderful day wherever you are, and thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see some more stuff, because more things are coming. Bye.